that's where they're at. All right. My name is Marisol Centeno, and I am the president of the League of Women Voters Miami Day. Woohoo! Go League! Well, us, together with you guys and so many other organizations, we were able to get this as a early voting site, and we gotta use it, guys. Come on, we gotta get out the vote. We gotta get the people out here. You gotta get your family, your friends. You come. You gotta exercise your right to vote. This is why we're here. We're partying and stuff, but this is serious business. Every election is really, really important, but in this one, we have constitutional amendments that we have to vote on. We have all kinds of information that you can figure out which way you want to vote. The important thing is to exercise your right to vote. When we vote, we make our decisions that impact our lives, that impact our future, especially for you guys. I'm basically like over middle age or something like they're saying, right? But you guys are in your 20s, so this is gonna impact you for at least the next 20 something years. When you purchase your house, when you go in front of the judge, etc., etc. So you guys gotta come out and vote. Be informed, be educated, go to vote411.org. It's a nonpartisan organization. You can find out who your candidates are and what they say about things that matter to you. Housing, environment, transportation, all of that stuff. They say that you guys are not interested in voting. I say different. I've been here, I've been at Miami Dade College, Kendall, I've been at Wolfson, I've been at North Dade, I've been at FIU, and young people are really interested. They're really involved, they really wanna go have a say in what happens to them. I say you show up by showing up to vote, casting your own foreign ballot, and let's do it guys. It's your voice, your vote, your future. Thank you. What's up, MDC? My name is Shaquasia Fedrick, and I serve as the Miami Day College Student Government Association President. And my name is Talia Rodriguez, and I serve as the Vice President for Student Government Association right here at North Campus. Are you guys excited to be here today? Yeah. But are you guys excited to vote? Yeah. Ooh, that wasn't loud enough. Are you guys excited to vote? We got it less than two minutes away from here. I want to see you guys party here, but I also want to see you guys walk into the library with your ID ready to vote. It's right there in the library. It's been open since 7 a.m. this morning, and all you need is your ID. Monday to Sunday, guys, there's no excuse for you guys to say, oh, I couldn't vote, I didn't have time, I had to go to work. It's right there. You got 10 minutes from class, you walk yourself to the library, and you vote because you want your voices to be heard. You don't want to complain when the election's over that you didn't get the guy that you wanted to run for governor, that you didn't want that amendment that didn't pass to pass just because you didn't have time to vote. So you gotta make your voices heard. So we're here today to vote, okay? The conversation should be voted. Ladies, if a guy come up to you trying to talk to you, you gotta ask him, did you vote? You gotta ask him, okay? Thank you guys. Hi everyone! Uh, good to see you here today. Aren't we excited? Woo! My name is Rebecca Diaz and I am an Andrew Goodman Ambassador at Miami College Wolfson Campus. I'm here to talk to you today about voting just like the rest of us here. We all really think that voting is important. Do you think that voting is important? We are in a position right now where we, you can use the power in front of us. Every single day, I have to take a bus and I have to take a metro. One hour just to get to school. My friend, she has to have two jobs just to pay for the ticket to be able to go to the metro. We have jobs, we have school, we have homework, we have a lot of stuff we need to take care of. And voting is one of the things that shouldn't be hard for us. But we need to know that we have to use our power to vote here and right here and now. We have people in a positions of power that we can choose whether or not we support what they say. And so what that means is that we have to go and we have to vote. Can I hear you all say, making some noise right now? If we all want to vote right now, that's the power that we have. Okay, thank you. All right, let's get out and vote, people. Come on, call your family, call your